Katrina was something I wouldn't wish that on nobody. Hurricane Katrina, a superstorm that claimed the lives of more than a thousand people, a storm New Orleans native Herbert Collins will never forget. People that was out there trying to scuffle to get themselves to safety, and the wind just kept on blowing and the water just kept on rising. Residents were ordered to leave New Orleans. Many didn't, including Herbert, his brother, and 87-year-old mother, who was blind. You see, if God's going to take her, he's going to take her right here, right there in New Orleans. I said, ah, you ain't staying here, and God ain't, God ain't ready for to take you. I said, you too tough to go. <laughs> The water began to rise. He and his family retreated to the upstairs patio. Only one priority was on Colin's mind, to keep his mother alive. We talked about it. We got it. When they came down, oh, we're going to go up there in the helicopter, Mom. We're going to all be in the helicopter. And we all were. Collins had never set foot outside of New Orleans his entire life. Coming to a new place was a scary experience. Me and my mom were coming with the district was on my back, on our back. But you see on that picture, that's the shorts I had. I washed it every day until I got some more clothes. Colin's mother passed away a year after Katrina. He is thankful she was able to come and enjoy the last of her days in Columbia. I thank God for the mother that I had that took care of me all the way to a child and she turned around and hooped me with my children. Like I'm always thinking about New Orleans. And I'm going to think about the one that lost their life that they didn't have a chance to get out. In Columbia, Leah Holloway, Watch Fox News.